everyone! In this episode, we forage for the edible pine mushroom in the Adelaide Hills, South Australia. We show you how to find them and what you're looking for. Okay, so what we've got here are pine mushrooms, saffron milk caps, Lactarius deliciosus, and they are the most prized mushroom in Spain and Russia and pretty much over Europe. And they are super delicious. <laughs> We've got like a few little ones here which are my preference to get the small ones but they have like normally a hollow stem and gills on the bottom good for, for cooking yep. <laughs> and good for nutrition as well because they have this really bright pigment and pretty much all mushrooms have um, really good antioxidant properties milk caps hold up in stews and soups like a um, shiitake mushroom yeah and you can dry them so texture wise they they really hold their integrity so they kind of hold up to a lot of cooking you can just chuck them on a barbecue for 20 minutes <laughs> and they're delicious how do you know if a pine mushroom is the real deal um so you come up to it and it when it's young it will be it'll have like a dome face with a with a dimple in the middle and when you cut into it when you cut into any part it should produce a really bright fluorescent orange milk so you'll see there's this really fluorescent orange milk that comes out of it and that's a good sign that that means that you know that they're pine mushrooms and what will happen is if you bruise it anywhere in about uh, half a day they'll turn really blue and green just like that when they're decomposing they'll turn that wherever you bruise it there's lots of different kinds of mushrooms and edibles in the woods so if you want us to do more foraging videos leave us a comment and let us know So we've got these mushrooms here and um... Oi, hold them still man, you're shaking like a crack addict. I haven't enough beer. Oh, fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to say it? I'll hold it, you say it. No, alright. Well you say it, I'll hold it. I don't know, what are you saying? Oh, okay. <laughs> try to tell them that, that, <laughs> that the, the, the whiter the, the out, outside is, you know, the whiter these bits, okay. um, is... Oh. is <laughs> If it's whiter, it's, it's fresh, fre younger. more fresh. Yeah, so, and, yeah. and the, the sack too. <laughs> you think, this is like a super old one. So that'll be like kind of wet, dark, or um, have really shitty gills. But these are nice. And this is what we're going for. They're more white, and when you cut them, there'll be heaps more brighter milk. And that's why they call them milky whatevers? Saffron milk caps. <laughs> Due to the milk. <laughs> uh, I don't think I'm going to drink that, guys. I'll probably just drink this beer. Oh, uh, yes. Nectar of the gods. If only this thing grew out of the ground once a year, I'd really stock up. They live around pine trees. They're an introduced mushroom. They were introduced with the radiata pines. So we've got lots of natural pine, uh, lots of SA pine forests and walking trails and stuff that you're allowed to go through and it's this time of the year where it started June um, and so we're autumn. coming close to the end of the season. So when would you start picking these Sasha? They started this year in May um, and last year it was kind of late May. Yeah. I think it was even earlier than May here but basically it's more about the conditions of the like of the rainfall and, and the areas it changes area. different areas. Yeah. Yeah. So they always need like a shock condition. So it's normally like after summer when there's a big, big downfall and then a few sunny days, they'll pop up and then they keep going pretty much all of August. But this year we've had an excellent fun. As pine mushy season has come to an end, it's time for our final cook up. If you want to learn how to cook mushrooms, be sure to subscribe and there will be upcoming videos with recipes and much more. So stay tuned. What did you down there, little fella? Hey? Sword fighting? Well, perhaps not now, mate. A bit later, hey? After dinny. <laughs> oh, throw them in the back. And the spores. Let's yeah. throw them in there. Smash it, smash it. <laughs> <laughs>